So yeah, y'all, I'm right on time because I was supposed to have it inspected by March. So we're not late. She didn't even recognize me. She was like, Brittany, is that you? Anyone who lives in Michigan should be taking vitamin D in the winter because we do not get enough sunlight for your body to produce enough vitamin D. Oh, and I got, I'm about to text Zoe's friend's mom because when she was with us the other day, when we were at the freaking um, ice skating thing. I need to eat something. I don't want, my, I don't want a, my energy to run out too late in the day today because I think we're going to get an iced coffee today, you guys. It's very weird and just peculiar. This Tim Hortons is the worst. I told them I ordered three times and they still hand me a, a freaking iced coffee with no cream in it. What? That is irritating. We need some hydration, child. We need some hydration under our eyes, honey, honey. Mm -mm. We're not doing any shopping today. We're not. We want to, yes we do, but we're not going to because we have priorities and we don't do instant gratification over here. And we want to invest back into our business. That's what's most important right now. So, yes. A Debbie Carr, but I want to talk to y'all about something, okay? For all the other micro YouTubers that have subscribed to me, okay? I just got a comment on one of my videos, someone saying sub for sub, okay? Nothing, but I still can't get you on my head. What's up, y'all? It's Monday, February the 21st. I don't like this lip color, y'all. It's just the first thing I grabbed that was in my purse, but I don't like it. Mm. We gonna wait till it fade off, though. I'm gonna put something else on. Um, yes, the girls are in the house. We're just gonna run, go run a few errands. That's what's on the agenda for today, okay? So, we're going to go to BJ's and get their snack for the week. We're going to where else are we going? We're going to go to the pharmacy and get my medication. And we're going to go get our ring inspected. That's what we're doing today. Yep. Y'all, my ear is still freaking bothering me. All right, you guys, we're going to Tim Hortons first. We're going to grab us a coffee, okay? I'm going to grab some coffee and I don't know, maybe a little wrap or something. You know. As I told you guys, sometimes I don't. It's very weird and just peculiar. Sometimes I don't even really finish my coffee, but it's just getting coffee just feel like it's a part of my day. I'm getting ready for my day. I mean, I save it. Like later on, I might put it in a microwave if I don't finish it, but yeah. I don't know. It's actually kind of a nice day. I might take my coat off. All right, y'all, let me find my debit card before I get to the front of the line, because y'all know, y'all know where I'll be. y'all right, i ordered a little sausage sausage egg and cheese wrap too because i need to eat something i don't want my i don't want to, my energy to run out too late in the day today because i know i already have to do laundry and help journey with homework and when i fast for long periods throughout the day then i'll be ready to go to sleep at like 7 30 so i need to stay up tonight y'all I need to job. We need to. We need to clean the fridge out. We need. We got a lot of stuff to do, and I want to get this stuff done today because, like I said, tomorrow the girls going back to school, and then I can just go to the suite during the day and worry about my stuff I have to do down there because I do have stuff to do down there too. Yes, yes we do. Yes. So yes. This Tim Hortons is the worst. I told them I ordered three times and they still hand me a, a freaking iced coffee with no cream in it. What? That is irritating. That is irritating. Like, it's really not that hard to... Hello? Hello? Alright, y'all. I had to taste it before I pull off because, child, y'all know. Y'all know as like, soon as you pull off and your stuff ain't right, you be like, what the heck? What the heck? Alright, y'all. We're sitting at the pharmacy. My prescriptions are vitamin D because anyone who lives in Michigan should be taking vitamin D in the winter because we do not get enough sunlight for your body to produce enough vitamin D. Um, my thyroid medication, which y'all, I kind of take mine. I shouldn't, this is probably not a good thing, but I take, sometimes I take mine just according to how I feel. Because if I go two weeks straight taking it, then I'll get like a shaky, anxious feeling. So sometimes I have to skip days. I can my, I can feel when my love, y'all see what I'm saying? I can feel it 
but it's been a few days that maybe that's why my voice sounds like hoarse and i sound tired because i told y'all i didn't come get it over the weekend because it's just like a little small one and here where i come see my doctor and they were closed so i'm about to get that and i have some eye drops because since i changed my diet and i eat very clean for some reason i have very very dry eyes and yes, so when I went to get my glasses, they gave me a prescription for some lubricating eye drops or whatever. So that's where we're getting out of here. Another family update. My grandmother on my dad's side texted me last night. I gotta text her back too. I'm very bad at that. I would read a text y'all and sometimes just be doing 15 million things and never text back. Um, I push myself to like text my clients back right away so I don't forget. But I need to text her back. Um, but yes. Hi, Grandma. Love you. Uh, where's my phone? Where's my phone? Oh, and I got, I'm about to text Zoe's friend's mom because when she was with us the other day, when we were at the freaking um, ice skating thing, I had I brought her skate rental and then she wanted to switch out the size and they made her pay and I, I was like well you know she was a kid I should have went up to the counter with them and so told them she didn't wear them she just wanted to change the size so I wanted to text her mom because I was gonna give her the money back because when Zoe's friends come with me I don't want them to spend their money I just don't feel like it's courteous like you know if we're going somewhere then I'll just pay like y'all know Cause I would want someone to do that for my child too. I wouldn't want my child to feel like, oh, do I have enough spending? Y'all know what I'm saying? Not that they don't have money, but y'all, y'all know. So yeah, I'm about to. Uh, as soon as I figure out where I put my phone, text my grandmother back, and uh, text Zoe's friend's mom. Text Zoe's friend's mom and it takes my grandmother back. So, shoot, I need a mask to go into this. Uh, go into here. Let me find a mask, y'all. I don't have any masks in my car because y'all know I usually leave them at the suite. I have the pack of disposable ones. So, hopefully, they just let me get my prescription. Honeys, we have our prescription. The sun, y'all, the sun. Cause we got to stay healthy. The lady in the pharmacist, she didn't even recognize me. She was like, Brittany, is that you? I'm like, yeah, I lost some weight, ma'am. <laughs> so yeah, um, I think we're gonna go to get our ring inspected first. Next, that's what we're gonna do. I was thinking about something I want to tell y'all. I need to um, freaking uh, wax my eyebrows, but I'm gonna do that tomorrow when I go to the suite. I need to wax my eyebrows and do me some hydration. We need some hydration, child. We need some hydration under our eyes, honey, honey. Mm -mm. All right, honey, is we're at the mall. Child, I can't see uh, the sun. Child, okay, is it adjusting? Okay, that's better. We're at the mall. We're gonna go get our ring inspected. We're not doing any shopping today. We're not. We want to, yes we do, but we're not going to because we have priorities and we don't do instant gratification over here. And we want to invest back into our business. That's what's most important right now. So, yes. That's it, y'all. 
Um, if you are in Detroit, okay, <laughs> or Redford, feel free to book a web uh, an appointment on my website if you want your eyebrows cute or your lashes cute, child. BrittanyJasmineAesthetics.com. But look, um, I want to show y'all how to card look the inspection card. Just how the information on the top and where that's where you fill in the dates for when you get inspected. Dre got this from my ring from Hillsburg. He went to the one in um, Gray Lakes Crossing because it's closer to his job where he works. But um, I'm quite sure they have one in here and I'm quite sure you can do, do the inspections at any store. So yeah, we're going in here. We're at Oakland Mall, y'all. Oakland Mall, chill. Oh, and for anybody who's new, this is the ring. This is the ring, you guys. Oh well, yeah. I'm glad they're gonna clean it because I have some jewelry cleaner for like, you know, when lotion and stuff get on it and it starts to look dull, but I think they steam clean it so it's gonna look really nice and like shiny and stuff. That's what we want. That's what we want. If y'all don't already know, K is not a good place to get jewelry. Everything is very expensive and overpriced. It's not a good place to buy jewelry. So yeah, y'all, I'm right on time because I was supposed to have it inspected by March, so. We're not late. Oh yeah, yeah. The warranty is lifetime too, as long as you keep up with things, make sure. So if you ever, you know, lose a stall or anything, it's lifetime forever. Did you guys hear her say she lost a stall? So he's inspecting it right now. Oh really? Okay, I don't. I, I was telling um, I, wanna, I got a YouTube channel. I wanted to tell them about it. I was talking to some, no, you're fine. I want to tell them what you were saying. So oh. I was talking to a nice lady in the store, you guys, and she said um, she lost one, a stone, and she had her ring for 10 or 11 years, but they replaced it, and it took like six weeks. So at least it still got replaced. <laughs> yeah. You guys, my ring has a matching band to it that Dre's gonna add, of course, when we get married. Um, and I've been saving, putting a little bit away because I want to get him something really nice that he would really like. So, you know, I want, I want him to have something nice. All right, y'all. He wrote it down on my card, so I'm good until August, and um, my my ring is nice and shiny. So that's it. We're getting out of here. It's a lot All right, y'all. We're at BJ's. I took my coat off because it's kind of nice. It's 47 degrees. Yes. Um, all we're getting out of here is a case of Capri Suns and um, some chips for them for school for their snack. That's it. Um, Dre brought a bunch of meat the other day when he went grocery shopping when it snowed a lot. So I took out some um, steak. I'm going to make some steak tonight. Mm, and I don't know. Probably some potato something y'all i think it's something let me just find my bj's card and stuff before we go in here all right y'all i just found my debit card but i want to talk to y'all about something okay for all the other micro youtubers i have subscribed to me okay i just got a comment on one of my videos someone saying sub for sub okay if you are a youtuber sub for sub is just stupid there's there's no reason at all to be doing that because if you genuinely enjoy youtube and you plan to be doing it for a while or you really want to get something out of it you really enjoy it then your subscribers are going to come to you because they like your content or they relate to you okay so you do not do sub for sub okay if you do sub for sub okay 
you're gonna have a bunch of people subscribe to your channel but ain't nobody gonna be watching you ain't gonna get the watch time hours and most of the time if you do that sub for sub it, somebody will subscribe and then they'll just unsubscribe when you subscribe to them like so even the whole time I've been doing YouTube I never did sub for sub because I don't understand that I'm not gonna subscribe to someone's channel just for them to subscribe back if, if you're not creating content that i like or i enjoy or that i can relate to or that's even worth me spending 20 minutes to watch it then no like no no now there's some people that i am watching um girl what's your channel our family our journey or our journey our family okay y'all can go check her out she um I like she's a good mother you know she's relatable cool she not insecure you know what I'm saying so it's a couple people that I have been subscribed to that of course I still go check in and comment and stuff but sub for sub is not going to get you anywhere you might have a lot of subscribers but if you ain't got no watch time hours child then it's just messing up your analytics okay so I'm letting y'all know don't be doing it just just work on improving your content and doing what you got to do because no no this no no now like I said I will have some situations where it'll be some uh freaking some people who like may be Detroit vloggers too, right? And I, you know, if they say sub for sub or something, I must, I might subscribe and support them if they are smaller channel than me. And just, you know, because they doing stuff around Detroit too. And I'm like, oh, what they doing today? Where they going today? That type of thing. But you, sub for sub is not going to get you anywhere. That's really a shortcut for someone who is just... Mm, want to get right to the YouTube paycheck and not really put in the work but it's it just gonna mess with your analytics so don't be doing it y'all don't don't be doing it just just keep your uploads keep improving your stuff because I'm telling y'all that that don't make no sense that don't make no sense when you see people say that stuff or something you know they're not really into YouTube because they enjoy it and they're not really here for the for the long haul it's just you know a way for them to make some money real quick so don't be doing that y'all all right let's get into bj's what's the basket y'all we gotta put this purse in there because this purse is heavy child All right, y'all, they don't have any Capri Suns today, so I guess we gotta get Kool-Aid jammers. I think these, well, I, I guess they say 55% less sugar. I always brought Capri Suns instead of Kool-Aid jammers because they had less sugar, but we get a case of these, y'all. We're getting the same thing, y'all. We always get the plain better made. Uh, should I get barbecue this time? I don't remember if Journey likes barbecue. I just get plain. Alright y'all, it's 2.31 p.m. Uh, I got back just in time because Dre's not here. He must have just left out for work. So, I'm about to grab this kid's snacks, take it in the house, and um, y'all know I got to do homework with Journey tonight. Get, I want to get the laundry washed up for the week because it just helps my week flow better. Y'all know, y'all know. I can't be looking for socks and stuff in the morning. No. So, I'm going to get the laundry done. And then um, I want to get on this treadmill and get a couple miles in because that's my stress relief. Like, just walking on the treadmill. And I might do a few little exercises to work on my arms, kind of tone them start toning my arms a little bit i told y'all i have a gym membership i just I don't, I don't have time to go like i have not been having time to go like my business is more important honey we just have to get on a treadmill until until some stuff shake up a little bit but yes that's it for today um i hope y'all are feeling blessed and well as always and you guys make sure that you are up being productive and working on your goals um so I'll see y'all tomorrow. Tomorrow we'll go, we are going to work. We'll be at the suite. Y'all go ahead on and be blessed. Bye.